<clears throat> Greetings. Whoo! So, undecided today whether or not I will float on day seven. My body is going through some shifts. I can really, really feel it. I'm hearing things so far away that are seem so crystal clear. In the shower this morning, I was able to really feel like the water running down my body. Like even like drop by drop, just going down my body. I uh, left the tank last night feeling super hyper aware and super hyper sensitive and just super attuned to another frequency it feels like. Like perception seems to be shifting. <laughs> Even if it's a small shift, it's shifting in a way where it's noticeably different. And so what I'm gonna do today at minimum, we'll see how I feel after this, but I'm here by the river, found a little spot. Freaking Boise, man, love it so much. I'm gonna meditate here for an hour, just as if I was in the float tank. We have people floating that like 60 yards from me and I can hear them <laughs> like freaking nothing, it's nuts. So I'm gonna really see how this plays out and we'll see how, how I feel afterwards if I want to still float tonight. But um, I'm feeling like calling day seven a day of rest and integration because I want this process to be beneficial. I don't just want to do 30 days in a row to say I've done 30 days in a row. I want it to be an actual beneficial process in which I learn and which I can freaking apply when I'm learning and integrate the lessons that are coming or the feelings that are being brought to the surface or the senses that are being like attuned and fine-tuned like if I'm just doing this for a number for some goal for my ego what's the point of even doing this so whew, day seven rest and integration let's see how much different pure meditation feels like I'll be back here in about an hour thank you <clears throat> it's amazing how much we don't pick up on it's amazing how much we miss all day, every moment, internally, externally, whichever. I've been able to really hear and listen to the water. Like over there, and 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 right here, and right here, like being able to better pinpoint the direction of sound, where sound's coming from. Whew. It's pretty wild having like your senses like deprived and sensory deprivation. Now this week for six hours now I'm able to like hear things as if I've never really heard them before. Or able to feel things or feel my breath or breathe better or breathe differently or pay more attention to the subtleties that we're around or that we experience, whether it's freaking drinking water or sleep or sound or breath or nutrition or sensation or sitting in your posture, like everything's like, these like big pictures are getting broken down like little by little, little by little. I'm able to really pay attention to like each minor movement or each minor moment within these big, broad concepts. It's amazing how healing nature is too. Just being out here, I feel way better now. 
I can be able to actually absorb and integrate and contemplate and feel and experience and reflect and ponder and wonder and, and grow and freaking expand. <laughs> Woo. That one's fun. I don't know right now. Day seven in the books. Pro probably won't float tonight. We put chemicals in on Sunday night that um, you shouldn't float right after to keep the water nice and clean for everybody. So probably just gonna chill, work on some things, reflect some more, work on a program I've been developing and really put this new found information, this new sense of grounding and balance in the play. And we'll see what comes of it. We'll see what thoughts can flow through this calmer state of presence or beingness. I wasn't expecting to take any days off during this, but I've really been learning to listen to my intuition more and more the past few years, and perhaps this process has begun a different route than I anticipated or expected, but I'm, a I'm able to roll with it and flow with it and adapt and evolve, so let's see where these 30 days go, but this is really powerful so far, and I'm pretty, I'm pretty stoked for this, again, in a different way. A super different way like I'm feeling the benefits outside of the tank substantially like deeply in ways that I wouldn't have been able to anticipate without even experiencing these sensations Whew. many doors open many doors open perception shifts with each new experience especially when doing something that you've never done before that many times in a row Whew. Thank you all. Much love.